Hey guys, Jonathan Graham here. And today I'll be showing you this, how to make this origami I just designed. It's a little tote bag. And you can fill it with candy or whatever. This is from a single square of paper, a little handle. And that'll be, that's what I'll be teaching today, this origami tote bag. This bag is from a six inch square, so that's what we'll use today. This is a dual, dual paper, so whatever color you want to be, the outside of your tote bag, have that facing down. In a fold in half, like this, fold in half diagonally, unfold. Now we're going to do what's called a kite base. We're going to fold the corner here to there, and this into the middle, to the center crease like this. And now we're going to take this and fold it in half. We're going to bring this point up to this point so that they meet. Next we're going to fold these flaps over the edge here. Crease it really sharply as well. You want to do a good crease for this. And then unfold. And now what we're going to do is we're going to unfold here. We're going to take this point and fold it down how far? Say about like that. And we're going to inside reverse fold it. Like that. So it goes inside like this. And now we're going to unfold here and make a crease here. Crease along this edge and this edge. And these flaps we're going to fold underneath. So we're going to take this purple flap here and make sure you can see this. And I'm going to fold it underneath here like that. That secures this side of the tote bag. And then we're going to take this other flap and the crease will start pretty much down in the corner there. Roll it behind inside like that. So those flaps are tucked behind. And now we're going to make a new crease between this, these two creases here going to this corner. And bring these two creases together, these mountain folds, and pinch a new fold behind. And do the same on this side. You're going to bring those two together. And crease it on the inside. And now we're going to make our little handle for our tote bag. We're going to take this point and tuck it into here. And if you want, you could leave it like this. But I like to do to make the handle a little sturdier and a little better looking is I narrow it. So I just take this point and fold it in and narrow this down. inside the, the bag here. And that just narrows the handle down and actually strengthens it a bit here. And then same over here, you're going to fold it in a bit. Careful not to tear the paper. Oops! Sometimes it'll come open on you. This paper I'm using is kind of a shinier paper. so. And you're going to fold this in all the way along here and you can narrow the handle a bit. Kind of gives it a better look and it sort of strengthens the bag a bit. And there we go. Flatten it down. Bring this up a little bit here. And there it is, an origami tote bag. And this is from a, and if you want to make it more durable the handle you can glue it, but of course being origami, I'm not going to use glue, but you can if you want. But that is the simple tote bag from one square of paper. It'd be great for like Halloween. You could put candy in these and they could look like little trick or treat bags. Hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video.